What's going on everybody? Rob here, aka Trev2323, TRV 2323. Right now I am on Indianapolis Boulevard, Adventure Day 1720 Indianapolis Boulevard, I mean, not Indianapolis, no, Calumet Avenue, 1720 Calumet Avenue. And if you can see, I am in the strip mall that everybody knows where, uh, what is that? Free Pizza and Richway Euros is. Capri Pizza and Richway Euros right there. The sun's behind me, so let me get a little bit closer. What I want you to show is there is a new business here. We gotta do the video for the El Poro Ranchero because we didn't go in there yet. But I like trying to show the local area of the local businesses. And I really, really do like the owners of here. We went in there, we talked to them, and everything was awesome. It is called Ixa, I-X-X-A, Ixa Coffee Roasters and Plants. This is, there's Richway Euros, VIP Nails, Capri Pizza, those are staples of the area. But with the Ixa, it is a coffee, they, they roast their own coffee bean right here. The coffee beans are physically roasted right here and they're connoisseurs of coffee. But not only are they connoisseurs of coffee, they're connoisseurs of tropical plants. Look at all these tropical plants. If you have a tropical plant or you want a tropical plant, this would be a place to come to grab your tropical plant because they're very knowledgeable of the plants that they're selling. Uh, if you can see here what they got. I got a couple of these at home, but I don't got all of these. There's some beautiful ones right here. Where's this one with these? Look at this right here with the purplish leaves. Look at that right there. That's so beautiful. They have hand rolled incense right here. And which one were you showing me, my love? Hmm? Which one were you showing? Oh, no, I was just saying there was a different one. Oh, here, right here. Oh, this with one the purple really leaves. Like and some of them, they look fake and they're actual plants. They're actual plants. This is a, oh, I forgot the name of that one right there. But they also have coffee, uh, uh, stuff for your coffee. Eeks the coffee from Peru. Colombian, Guatemala. There's your barista. <laughs> this is the owner right here. What's your name? Jose. Jose. This is Jose from. How you say it? From Ixa. Ixa. Ixa Coffee. Can I see your roaster back there? Absolutely. And this is Stephanie right here. Hi. <laughs> now these are beans from Latin America. You yeah, said. Yeah. This is from Colombia. This is from Colombia. These are from. Uh, uh costa rica and then we have different beans here from all over the world for example this one is from this one is from uh peru as you can see here they're a little different they're called natural naturally washed coffees or naturally processed and then we have different um, other raw beans here but and then we also have the roaster this is a beautiful back. roaster yeah this is my my workspace my lab uh, but we definitely roast anywhere from 15 to 20 pounds every single time. Um, and we provide to local, other local shops, but um, also our favorite thing, providing to our shops. So oh, this, this is awesome. With, with the logo right on the side. Yeah, this is, have, oh my God. So it opens up. So like when you do want to roast, um, very easy to do. I can't pass it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You know, uh, it's all. Oh my God, this is awesome. Yeah. And about how much uh, pounds would you roast at a time? 15 pounds typically, but you can roast up to 25 uh, on the DJ coaster. That's awesome. And this is for your cold brew? Yes, that's what I was getting ready earlier. This is for our cold brew. Um, we're about to go ahead and start brewing for the, uh, the next batch of kegs. So it's typically five pounds a keg. Um, you brew it for anywhere from 18 to 24 hours. Uh, brew it overnight, you get it in the morning, and you and, keg it. And that's supposed to be like, my daughter loves cold brew. She says there's more caffeine, is it true? Uh, I, I don't know. I mean, she, not she says she said it makes her feel better, that yeah. it makes her <laughs> <laughs> The cold brew coffee. So, okay, but also here you got, you got drip Americano, cold brew, rose matcha, never heard of that before. Golden milk, Mayan latte, latte, rose lavender, honey, vanilla, chai. My, what is that? Yeah, so here at the bottom are all the flavors for our lattes. We try to keep it light so you can taste the coffee still. Um, you know, we don't have frappuccinos or anything like that. But with the rose, uh, that is a syrup that we use. Lavender, same thing. Uh, we use natural honey uh, for our honey lattes, vanilla syrups, and then chai and matcha. Chai is uh, like a, a tea-like syrup that we use, and the matcha is actually a tea. It's a green tea. Yeah, yeah. Um, so when you're making those, you know, you have really good alternatives to coffee. Those do have some content of caffeine in them. Ah. 
So, and this is Ixa. Ixa Coffee. Ixa and Coffee plants. and Plants. And I say there's a lot of you out there that you don't realize having a plant in your house is really good for the oxygen, the, the air and the oxygen. If you don't know how to take care of plants, let me start you off with one of these. These are snake plants. Snake plants, or they call them mother-in-law's tongues right here. If you do not know how to take care of plants, start off with one of these. These are super easy, but here's a, something, one of these. These are actually air scrubbers. A plant like this, if you have this in your house, it doesn't need a lot of sunlight. These are really easy to maintain and they scrub air at nighttime. When you're sleeping, these things are cleaning the air inside your house. They're really good to have. Now these are my nemesis right here. I cannot grow aloe vera plants. I really can't. Uh, I mean, it's like gone in 60 seconds with Eleanor. That was his nemesis. These are my nemesis right here. Although I may try another one, but we are going to purchase them that purple plant. That purple plant is beautiful. So we're going to try to maintain that at home. So if you know me, uh, I try to share everything that's going around locally to us. This is a place I would ask everybody in the Whiting, Hammond, Chicago, East Side area to stop in just to help out a new business, help out a small business. So this is Ixa Coffee and Plants. Talk to you later. So, so Here's a little pretty lady that we brought home. Medium light plant. I don't know the name of it yet. It's we right can Google there. lens it. It's on the back. I can't see it. It's in the middle. All right. Oh. Let's check it out when we get home. <laughs> oh, there it is right there. 